automated technology or other recognition technologies that can identify pest damage or help with pest insect management is of course ideal. Our understanding of pest insects used to only be based on experience or actually going out in the fields to inspect. Minimizing pest insect damage is a critical issue in Taiwan. Without effective pest control, severe crop loss may occur. Therefore, growers must adopt integrated pest management strategies. Taiwan, however, faces a shortage of farmers and an aging farmer's population. Fortunately, technology has provided pest management with a new path forward. Growers can use their mobile phones to connect to our system, the decision support system for intelligent pest management. Then, they just enter a keyword, for example, rice, and the system will show them information about pest insects that harm rice plants. Or, for example, if they type in brown plant hopper, the system uses AI input analysis to redirect them to relevant prevention techniques. Growers can use the system to search for both organic and conventional pest control techniques. Everyone can use this system, which is why it's one of the best tools for growers to access pest control information. Conventionally, testing for pest insects was done through the use of sticky traps. The traps would be placed for a week or two, then sent to the laboratory for analysis, and then the data would be sent back to the grower. But new AI and technological developments now allow quick integration of all the data and rapid reporting to the grower. The grower can then implement timely control measures. This intelligent pest detection system has been installed in around 10 sites over the past two to three years, such as in Jiayi, Yunnan, Tainan, etc. The system can be used for crops such as tomatoes or flowers like the Texas bluebell or orchids. And there are even some seedling applications. This has resolved many long-standing challenges for growers unable to control greenhouse pests, allowing them to be able to access information on how to manage pests and better tend to crops. High Point's Intelligent Pest Detection System is rated IP65 for water resistance and can be used in greenhouses or the field. It's also equipped with a solar panel that can provide it with enough power to be able to run without an external power source for up to 15 days. This system is designed so that the camera on the user end uploads images to the server. The server then processes the images to determine the number of pests, site temperature, humidity and luminosity. Growers can use their phones or computers to access visualizations of this data at any time for their growing site. The brown plant hopper is the pest predominantly responsible for rice crop damage during Taiwan's second planting season, July to November. It causes rice plants to quickly wither, severely stunts growth, and lowers yield and quality. The brown plant hopper detection and warning system can be accessed by downloading a mobile phone app. With just the app and some basic equipment, you can detect changes in plant hopper levels in your fields. This data is processed and sent back to the app where you can see plant hopper population levels represented in green, yellow, and red. So this detection system can be used to stay on top of changes in plant hopper levels. As agricultural machinery continues to advance, it is becoming more common to see UAVs used in the fields to spray pesticides and monitor crop growth. UAVs can very efficiently apply pesticides but require accurate input parameters in order to successfully control pest insects. Many factors can impact successful pesticide application, including pesticide quality, type of pesticide, UAV flight altitude, UAV speed, type of nozzle, etc. This means using a UAV to apply pesticides requires a relatively high level of skill. It's considered a high-tech pesticide application in order to help UAV pilots quickly learn how to correctly apply pesticide, our trials over the past few years have determined these pesticide application parameters so that even those who are inexperienced 
can successfully use UAVs to apply pesticides. The parameters help ensure homogeneous pesticide efficacy as well as safe pesticide application and effective pest control. The government has provided very useful input parameters for agricultural UAV pilots to be able to help the growers and work efficiently. The benefit of using UAVs to apply pesticides is that it saves precious time and effectively controls pest insects. Smart technological applications continue to advance and become more widespread, bringing greater convenience and benefits to hard-working growers. While once a task that demanded a large labor force and a significant amount of time, now technological integration has opened a door towards the future of pest insect management.